Ha, ha, ha. Here it comes. Were there any uh, either other design styles, eras, uh, industrial or not, that you pulled from for this build? Well, I, I've still gotten, between all of us here, I've looked at so many interiors that I, all of a sudden I'll go to another car auction and say, God, that was a nice interior. Look, I'm finding stuff in the 40s and 50s American that the dashboard's really clever, but they're just metal. So adding Bakelite or wood or something, fabric, wool, silk. So I'm, I'm getting, but I really want it to be functional. Some of these old dashboards were functional and they were pretty at the same time. Did I just say that? Then they weren't all gadgety, you know, I just, I don't need that much. Electric doesn't need that much. No. No oil pressure, none of that stuff. Do you want to have I guess they would be novelty gauges at that point. Are, do you plan on having some quote Yeah, there's going to be a clock in there and then something. I mean, the electric motor needs to know it's charging or discharging. Would you like to see some of that on? Because that is not, obviously, those gauges and stuff are the going one, to look very modern. Yeah, it has to look messed up. How's it looking? Great. Thanks. Got a lot of different angles going on here, that's for sure. I know, I was actually wondering how... It's really tough. You got, you, I probably have, I don't know, 10 to 20 different angles. And then it how do you know which... It curves and it goes down and it goes up and it's, it's rounded at the same time and... How do you know what, where to go, what angle to go? Just with? rely on my eye. And I know how the rubber is going to fit and sit inside here. So I just want to keep this gap as tight as possible. What? What Sorry. did I say? Sorry. It just started with the kitten comment, and it just it's just snowballed. Just with and the I want to keep this fit. gap. It's, just, yeah, it's, it's <laughs> terrible. Yeah, it is. Uh, Sorry, you brought it up. I know. You brought uh, the whole cat uh, kitten thing. I know. <laughs> but he slept on my face. What am I gonna do? Uh, Run with it. Yeah, so that's all I'm just trying to, and then I want, you know, when the door's shut, I want it to be, you know, an even reveal all the way through, you know? So that's hard too, because you gotta keep the depth, the same depth right here. So that's what I'm trying to finish off right here. I think I almost got it. And this will ultimately be covered with a, another Yeah, this land. gets a frame that okay. goes over it, yeah. So this frame will have the fuzzies and stuff yeah. and it'll go up against the glass. This will be an operational window here, correct? Yeah. Yep. This is really important because of the rubber. Perfect. This right here keeps the car quiet. Yes, it does. So it has to be perfect. So there's no noise. Good. Perfect. If I can just close this a little bit right here, I think I got it. and I can finish this piece and
I had a dollar for every time I, I've been in and out of this car <laughs> over the last year or so, I'd 